Paris is so beautiful. It really is. Some of the simplest th scenes are my favorite scenes, and it could be very, some, you know, just because somebody has given me the trust to be in an intimate moment and, and to capture an intimate moment. That, for me, is my thrill, you know. It's not some beautiful, fantastic, you know, photographic event. amazing. It's sort of strange to think how old it is. I don't think it's beautifully shot, but I just love the tone of it. And if you get to know Grace, it's just you, you, when you see her standing there, it means so much. As you see the film, you get to fall in love with Grace. You have to go charging ahead. You can't stay behind. Over the course of the film, that moment becomes even stronger. But to me, every time I see it, I love Grace. We started off making the film hating each other. She didn't want to have anything to do with the film. She thought it was one of Anna's ideas. And she looked at me like I was a cockroach running across the... And my feeling was, I don't want to film somebody who, who doesn't want to be filmed, so I just said, well, let's not film Grace. But we didn't know who Grace was. At some point, about five months into the film, we realized who Grace was, and that we had to, we had to include her in the film, and the director said, and you have to make the relation. I looked at him <laughs> like, are you crazy? She hates my guts. But we actually fell in love with each other in a, in a sense of, you know, by the end of the film, you'll see that she turns the tables on the film crew. Can you jump? Yeah, that's great, this one's great. Uh, one more, you get one more, okay? Okay. Oh, that's great! So get Monte here, in the same page, very right close to him, like that. Right. Jumping too. Awesome.